you are blessed for finding yourself on this particular channel i will entreat you to hit the subscribe button comment and share so that others too can have access and we're here it's about soul lifting messages that will reshape your level of thinking so far as your belief is concerned i got carried away while preparing this particular message because of its content how power packed it is have you ever think of it that life also have a spiritual aspect apart from the physical that we experience well let's go listen to this powerful teaching by apostle joshua Suleiman that will reshape your level of thinking so far as your religion is concerned. life is spiritual say one more time life is spiritual when i say life it means every other thing that life consists of academics is spiritual marriage spiritual prosperity poverty success when you understand the spiritual dimension of life it automatically puts you in a position of victory so that you begin to interpret things first from the plane of the spirit before giving it any intellectual you see intellectualism has killed a lot of people hallelujah there are so many families for instance that are going through things that you obviously know this is the devil but when you tell them this is not of god they will try to give it an intellectual i follow me now there are some of you for instance who do not believe that god put tithing to govern the prosperity of a believer's life you don't believe it when you see people come out to pay their tithe you just laugh say forget if you work hard no devil will stop you you really think so one more time say after me life is spiritual and our goal is to open you up to the realm of the spirit through the lens of the word of god notice notice my choice of words to open you up to the realm of the spirit through what because there are many ways of being open to the realm of the spirit through divination sorcery soothsayers you can go to the traditionalist in your house or in your village and he can do something and wash your eyes this is what a lot of prophets around nigeria do they go and by divination they concoct some things and suddenly they begin to hear and they begin to see what we do not understand is there are many planes in the spirit realm the fact that you are seeing the spirit does not mean you are seeing heaven or you're, no there are many planes in the realm of the spirit the realm of the spirit is a real atmosphere just like the earth hallelujah so when when you understand the spiritual implication of life you will know that you are a spiritual man all the time let me show you something first corinthians lord grant us grace to just put something on ground before our time is up first corinthians please first corinthians 2 let's see what the bible has to say first corinthians 2 from verse 13 and 14 first corinthians 2 verse 13 he said which things also we speak not in words which man's wisdom teacheth but which the holy ghost teacheth comparing what with what see your affair as a believer is entirely spiritual when you begin to reduce yourself from the spiritual realm down to the intellectual realm and the physical realm you will become a fool are you listening to me the bible says not the things that man's wisdom the word here is sophia man's wisdom men have ways of interpreting spiritual things someone is convulsing and you are telling the, the person this is a demonic thing they say no you see um something happened the person ate pepper and so on and so forth the bible says not man's wisdom this is the one that the holy ghost reveals are you listening to me how do you explain to someone that hiv is a spirit it's not just sickness it's a spirit it's not everyone that has hiv who had it through sex are you getting my point 
some people are shocked they just went to the hospital they check their blood and they say mr man you are positive to hiv one and two what happened and now everybody starts saying what what you have done in the secret now we have all known and you blame people you are interpreting things based on man's wisdom sophia hallelujah but when the holy ghost begins to guide you he will tilt your interpretation to spiritual things so when you see somebody annoyed at you or hates you you don't judge from the physical realm are you following me now you begin to look what is making this person do this and you will find out that this person may not even this person is reacting either to frustrations or to a need for spiritual help and you offer solution to people